at the allotment today um, and Susan were just looking at the courgettes now boy there are other clips on gardenville.tv about growing our courgettes yeah. planting our courgettes how you plant them and hey look at this I'm, I'm delighted these went in just as a seed you know, and they've really grown here right flower on the end it's the female flower that produces the courgette okay and then you have the male flowers which come up on these sort of long stalks like this here yeah there's another one coming up here and you need the insects that are flying around to take pollen from the male one to the female one to fertilize them to produce courgettes and listen what does the female one look like before she goes into flower mm, before well, you know the way before she well, gets to that stage there you can just see a courgette forming there. Yes. So how would tiny, the, another how would tiny, that have been pollinated? Um, At what stage good, like? Th that's a very good question because there's no bee going to get in there. No. I know that we have we have a beekeeper very close by here. Right. And last year everyone had bumper crops of courgettes. Because, because the bees, the bees are all around. The it's weather hasn't been good for bees this year. Well, you know well, what? And the bees, without our bees, we've no food. So, exactly, you know, this yeah. is a prime example but the, of how have, important the bee population is. It does produce both male and female flowers. Now, there are, there are recipes, too, for deep flower fried courgette flowers. Do them in batter and fry them. Oh, well, do you know what? Let's left. go to Caroline. You check out at Gardenville.tv what sort of recipe. Caroline will send that a first. couple of flowers to her and yeah. see what she comes up with. Definitely. Yeah, great idea. That's very interesting. Though.